This is Timothy McSweeney's Quarterly Concern, issue number 13, 2004, uh, hardcover. Uh, Chris Ware is primarily responsible for this issue. Uh, it's the comics issue, comics inside and out. The dust jacket folds into a large double-sided poster, color comics on one side, black and white on the other has an elaborate cover, it has a really nice looking cover. Uh, green and papers with white print design, a black cloth quarter binding which is stamped in gold. Uh, really nice end papers. Uh, one of their best looking covers I think. There are two special insert comics, uh, black and white King Cat and color Girls Against Pain. Put the condition of this at very good plus and good minus. Uh, the book is at least very good plus slight bumps, rubs to corners. The jacket has shelfware rubbing on the bottom edge, primarily at the corners, the flat folds. Similar wear to the top edge, but more pronounced, and there are several short closed hairs. Uh, I think it's a little better than good minus overall, which can't go wrong under grading. Um, I put, <laughs> it is what it is and what it is, it is a shelf worn at the top edge. Uh, so let's take, a, let's take a look at it here. Take it apart. Check the pictures out because they're not going to show, the video is not really going to show, but it lets me describe it better. We've got some shelf wear to the top edge. A little curl here, got three or four, five closed tears, shelf wear at the top, at the uh, corners. Also have shelf wear on the bottom edge also at the corners but less so. The shelf wear is most significant at the top edge and at the front where we've got several short closed hairs. There we go. Am I still right side up? I think so. We got a big newspaper size all color spread here. And the back side is black and white, except dead center. If you can see the reflection, dead center, there is a gold stamp right in the center. So well, that's the jacket. We put this at, at good minus. Um, I think it's better than that, but Girls Against Pain. Little color little color comic. And King Cat, black and white. King Cat has a little bit of Bend here. I've been tweaking it since I since I got it. There's a little there's a little bit of bend here. It's not creased, which is the main thing. I mean that can be so a little a little black and white comic here. This is a first printing copy. They did three printings on this. This is a first printing. And they did make changes between the printings. Uh, quite a number of edits in the second uh, printing. And also the third, the third printing has a typo on the copyright page.
black cloth quarter binding stamped in gold. Black and gold always look sharp. Really nice end papers for this. Really works well. Touch of uh, edge wear to the corners. They haven't been they haven't been bumped, but we've got a little bit of shelf wear to the corners. More at the top as with the jacket. Insert comics. There you go. The comics issue. Basically, this is Chris Ware's issue. Um, there you go. That's all I know to say about this copy.